Alex was hitting on a police officer. <laughs> I don't think you guys understand the anxiety that I get when Alex and I go out and about. I literally have to pray to God that the world is a good place, a nice place, because you know what? I can't deal with Alex. My blood pressure spikes every single time there's any kind of confrontation. Because I know that something wonderful is about to happen, but at the same time, something fucked is about to happen. So I'm driving Alex to school, right? I'm just in my Jeep, jamming out to my music, everything. And then out of nowhere, I get the fucking lights behind me. Yeah, fuck me. <laughs> Alex looks over at me and is like, what's happening? What, what's going on? Well, kid, technically I'm not supposed to be driving my Jeep because the license plates have been revoked because somebody got butt hurt over the fact that it says GF Karen. And we're in the get fucked Karen Jeep, so. The cop walks to my window, excuse me, sir, do you know why I pulled you over? Mama didn't raise no fool. I said, no, why did you pull me over? By the way, that's a good piece of advice. If a cop asks if you know why they pulled you over and you do know, just say you don't. You don't accidentally want to tell on yourself. Well, I pulled you over because your license plates are no longer valid. Oh yeah, that, look, I'm sorry. I ordered new plates. They're just taking forever to get here and it's just been a nightmare to deal with these personalized license plates, people. I do apologize. Hmm, I'm gonna need to see some driver's license and proof of insurance. I give her my license and proof of insurance and everything. She goes back to run it. Uh, dad, what's gonna happen? More than likely, kid, she's gonna run my shit and everything like that. See that I'm telling the truth about getting brand new plates and they haven't gotten here yet. And I'm probably gonna get a ticket and be sent on my way. Why don't you just talk your way out of the ticket? The fuck? How am I gonna talk my way out of this, Alex? I got you, bro. <sighs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> the police officer walks back up to my window, gives me my license, gives me my insurance, and here goes Alex. Hey, what's your name? Officer Mendez. Oh yeah, your name was on our last ticket that we got. Um, we don't write our names on the tickets. Are you sure? Because we opened it up and it said, fine. What the fuck? <laughs> Oh my God, you're too much. This unbelievable son of a bitch, it's actually fucking working. Oh yeah, hey, what are you doing October 15th? Why, what's happening on October 15th? My 18th birthday. The fuck? <laughs> and this lady cop, God bless her, is just dying out of laughter. And I'm completely baffled, I'm taken back, I'm just in shock like, what the fuck? As she's laughing, I start laughing and I say, oh my God, I taught him well, right? And y'all, this lady who was just crying, laughing, stops on a dime and just stares at me. <laughs> okay, wow, she ain't here for me. Fuck me, all right. <laughs> she rips the ticket out of the ticket book and hands it to me. I'm looking at it like, oh, okay, all right. You're lucky you're not getting another one because he's not wearing a seatbelt. Actually, that ticket's supposed to fall on him because he's 17 years old. Alex, fucking snitch. Don't worry, sweetie, I'm gonna let you off with a warning. The cop walks away, Alex looks at me and says, my game's on point. My game's on point. Mm. <laughs> I had no shot in hell. Alex was good though. <laughs>